Hello, my name is Sarah Marie. Welcome to or back to my channel. This is going to be a very impromptu video. So essentially what I have today, I have what feels like a present to me, okay? I have a big old box of crystals. Um, because what? So I do this thing that I like to call hobby hopping. Um, basically I go through hobbies like it's nobody's business and one of the current ones is I like crystals um yeah so coincidentally I also just opened a booth in a vendor store near me which is basically a place that you can rent a section and sell stuff so I decided I was going to sell crystals in said booth um because no one else is really doing it there and why not I mean then I get to see a bunch of pretty gems but I can also sell them so I thought I would bring you guys along with me while I open this box. Um, I'm gonna try to do this as fast as possible purely because the sunlight is going to be gone in like less than an hour. So let's just, let's get into it. Now I ordered all of this from Fair and I'm hoping they have a packing slip in here because I have my packing slip on my phone, but I'm recording on my phone. So let's just, let's get into this box because I am excited. Um, it's not a huge box, this box, <laughs> was uh this box was 120 dollars but it was 20 dollars for shipping so this is about 100 dollars of crystals right here um there's also a hole in the box i'm hoping we didn't lose any friends but let's get to opening this i'm so excited i'm gonna hurt myself i'm really i'm i'm kind of dangerous with blades gracie i can't you cannot help me open this one sorry you can barely see her, but Gracie is right here, sniffing the box pretty hardcore. Careful. I'm so excited. I honestly cannot wait. There we go. Okay. That was rough. Okie dokie. Oh my gosh. I am so excited. Okay. Um, I don't see a packing. Oh, there is a packing slip. Okay. Thank God. Because I'm not going to remember everything that I got. Um... And a little business card. Oh, cool. I think I can log into their website. Because like I said, I got this off of fair.com, which is essentially like a marketplace for wholesale businesses, like places that sell wholesale. Um, you do have to have a business license, like sales tax license to order from there. But it's pretty cool because there's a lot of like handmade goods. Um, a lot of the stuff is ethically sourced and sustainable. So it's a really cool place to get stuff for a shop. And that's really what I've been wanting to do is sell things that I can kind of like curate and buy myself and then sell. Um, I like to make and sell stuff, but it gets to be exhausting. I wonder, two of the things on this list are not highlighted, so I don't know if they're gonna be in this box. So we got some packaging. I'm so excited. This doesn't feel real, honestly. Okay, cool. So this is a bunch of the littler stuff. So this is a little baggie of clear quartz spheres. Um, they look pretty clear. They're really pretty. You can barely see. <laughs> Maybe if I show it in the sun, but yeah. So they're like this size. Oh, so these are actually the clear to smoky quartz spheres. Um, Maybe it's just the lighting. These all look just clear. I mean, I guess there's, you can kind of see there's some smokiness. So, so these are the clear to smoky quartz spheres. Now they're littler than I thought, but that's on me. I didn't look at the size very well. Um, but yeah, so there's those. And then I got a bunch of bracelets as well. So this one, I think, oh, okay. Yeah, so this one, it, these are stunning. Um, so these bracelets, let me try to show you. I'll get better. I'm not even going to try to show you these. I'm just going to get better clips later. So these are strawberry quartz and moonstone, and they are stunning. I really like these. Um, so these are two of the bracelets that I got. And then I also got this one right here. It was just mixed summer gemstones. Um, but I thought it'd be cute to have at least one of these. So I picked up one of these. I'm planning on kind of displaying all these bracelets together. And then I've got some obsidian bracelets. I got two of those. 
Um, I thought just might as well have some uh, obsidian bracelets. They're good for protection, you know. And then amethyst, of course, because it's my birthstone. And it's pretty. I'm excited to like price these out and like put them on display. Oh, I got more bracelets. I don't even remember everything I ordered, to be honest. This one, oh, I think this is, these are the fluorite bracelets. Um, they are cute. I love it. I love the color scheme. These are a whole vibe. Um, I can't wait to get better clips of these because they will look so good in the sun. I also have a snowflake obsidian bracelet. I just thought it was a nice variation and I kind of was just going crazy with the bracelets at that point. Um, I have some bigger clear quartz spheres here. Um, I'm, these ones are going to be interesting. I don't know how much of a profit I'll be able to make on these. I don't know. We'll see. But they are really small is my only worry. Now, I also got some selenite moons. I don't know. I think they're really cute. They'll be a great addition. This, I, <laughs> I spent a little bit more on this one. This is an amethyst sphere. Now, it's pretty cute. I mean, it's got a little bit of flash in there, which is pretty. Um, but it's not super purple. It could have, like, it could be a little bit darker. But I'm happy with it. I'm gonna have to charge... A decent amount for it but we'll see I mean maybe we'll see oh and I forgot a bracelet oh I got a smoky a smoky quartz bracelet it's really cute I'm tempted to like keep these for myself but I can't I need to sell them um I also got some sphere holders because I figured I got some spheres and I don't want them to roll off when I'm displaying them plus I can sell them oh that's cute that's so adorable it's perfect for this little ameth amethyst sphere and that's everything in this little bag. Ooh, yeah. These are the big things. Okay. I don't even remember. Oh, I got some towers and stuff too. I was starting to get sad. I was like, is this all I ordered? Um, but yeah, so I, this is a bag of, I think, fluorite tumbles. And they're a little dirty. I'm going to have to clean them up a little bit. But they look really pretty. It's green and purple fluorite. And... I don't know. I just, I wanted to get some tumbles and some other stuff that I could sell for a little bit cheaper just for the people who aren't like heavy into crystals, you know? Um, but yeah. So I'm going to see if I can grab the other, because I got a couple raw stones too, and I want to grab those first before we open any of the towers. I guess this is what happens when you order a pound. Um, I got some big chunks, some big old chunks of rose quartz, which is fine. And then I also got some rough labradorite because that's the stone I've been like the most obsessed with recently. Yeah, that's totally worth it. There's, there is some flash on some of these I can already see just with this low lighting and they're still dirty. So that the, I think the raw stones and the tumbled stones were the most worth it for me. Um, but I wanted to get some interesting stuff, you know, cause I don't want to just have all the stuff that you could go to like sleeping tiger and get you know what I mean I wanted to be able to have some stuff that's more like rare okay so I'm assuming these are going to be some of the obelisks oh no these are the selenite wands okay I got some of these oh wait they might be selenite towers this is a long roll of bubble wrap no so these are the selenite wands these are actually pretty big um yay oh and they're all individually packaged these are large I need to do better at paying attention to the size of stuff. I'm glad that these are big, but all of this, I'm like, that's how big this is? Either way, those are obviously pretty, and I just thought that I needed some selenite, because why not? Um, let me see. I am really excited about one of these things. It looks like I have two more things left. So... My reward after this is going to be to go make, get McDonald's because this, I think, is all the towers and they're smaller than I thought. That's on me. Ooh. Flower agate, man, is like one of my favorite stones for sure. I'm going to pull this out right now because I need, I need to see. Please tell me the points are intact. Yes. Okay. Cool. Oh my God. That's so pretty. I love flower agate. I just love it. 
Hannah thinks it looks like bacteria or like germs, but I think it looks pretty. I think it looks like little flowers. So those are stunning. I also got, I don't remember. See, I like crystals, but I'm not super well versed on them yet. This might be fluorite. It looks like fluorite. Yeah, 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 yeah. Purple green fluorite obelisk. And these are actually pretty big. It said two inches plus, and they're definitely bigger than two inches, so. These towers, man. These are, the towers are way more worth it for me. I guess I should have been new about the spheres because spheres are always more expensive. Um, but these are really pretty. You can see, I don't even know why I'm trying to show you in this footage. I'll show you later. Um, but there's like some, I don't know if you call it banding, but this is really pretty. This purple one, man, that's pretty. I love the noise they make when you touch them together. Okay. Either way, those are stunning. I've got more. I've got more towers because I guess I focused on buying towers. Ooh. Okay, so this is Angel Aura. I think it's quartz. Angel Aura quartz. Either way. I know that it's man-made. It's um, kind of like a heat-treated situation, but it's so pretty. And why not get stones that are pretty? Um, this one is my favorite because... I know that usually like things are quality if they're clear, but I love that you can see this like cloudy stuff on the inside. Like it like reflects, oh my gosh, I love it. This is really pretty. You can even see it in this footage. Um, you don't even need the natural sunlight to make these look pretty. This one is also really pretty. It's got more like cloudiness towards the bottom. Oh, and you can see the rainbow. Okay, so those are the Angel Aura. I also got some Smoky Quartz because I was in a Smoky Quartz mood, I guess. I Hi, Grace. Ooh, yes. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that was a lot of math for me. Okay, so I think a lot of these have six sides, which isn't super important other than the more sides, the more expensive. I've been learning a lot of stuff on YouTube the past like three days <laughs> um, because I decided I wanted to do this on an impulse for sure, but it's okay. I am excited. Um, these smoky quartz towers are really pretty. Like this one even has like inclusions in it. I'm obsessed. I'm just hoping, yeah. Okay, as long as they stand on their own, I'm totally chill. But like these are really pretty. I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to say. I just thought I'd bring you along the journey with me so you could see, excuse me, so you could see all of what I'm unboxing because I don't know, I think they're pretty. I can see how this much stuff is $100. I, I think I got a pretty good deal, but now I know what this is because this is the last thing in the box, I think. Yes. So let's get that away from me. It's in my way. Jesus, I almost dropped all the towers. Um, these are some more towers. These are selenite towers. I don't remember how many I got, but I picked the bigger size tower. I like that they wrap in a lot of bubble wrap, but this is a lot of bubble wrap. Okay, so I got three selenite towers, which I think is technically, is it satin spar? Because it's not the clear selenite. I don't know. Everyone calls them selenite. I'm going to go with that. But I actually have one almost exactly like these um, that I use all the time. And they're just so pretty. So I decided I should get some uh, selenite towers, especially because I wanted to have some stuff that was like more affordable for the girlies who wanted the crystals, but the girlies that didn't want to invest $20 in a crystal, because I can relate, you know? I, I can totally relate to that. So I tried to get stuff that was like a wide variety of prices, a wide variety of like sizes and types um I definitely want to order more but we'll see I have to start selling some first I also ordered some incense that I thought I could put in the booth as well so I have they're basically bulk incense so people can pick like 10 for a dollar and I don't know I want to create like a like a witchy a cool vibe to my booth so yeah um what what is what is my favorite what what is my favorite I feel like I should tell you my favorite thing um, not gonna lie, it's this. This, the flower agate. 
this is stunning. I can't even really get close because then the sun disappears, but I'm in love. I'm in love with the flower agate towers. So yeah, I don't know. I got a lot of crystals. I'm gonna try to sell them. We'll see how it goes. I don't know. I'm, I'm excited. All of this is really pretty. The only thing I don't know if I'd do again is the spheres. Only because I have a hard time believing someone's gonna pay $3 for a sphere this big. Like it's a marble. But maybe. I don't know. Either way, I'm getting distracted. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, this is, I just, they're all so pretty. They're like my new babies. Either way. I'm gonna go because I need to go get food because I'm starving. So I hope you have a great rest of your day or night or whenever it is. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and see you later.